Hi guys, we're back again. We're going to do the both teams to score racket as people seem to be loving it. A lot of requests for it, which is great. Thank you very much. Please keep them coming in. Um, drop me a comment whenever you want, either on YouTube here or on Twitter at Phil Bars. More than happy to answer any questions you've got. Um, like I said in the ACA video, which if you haven't seen, I'll leave a link in the bio for um, FA Cup. So I've taken teams forming their leagues and, and a little bit. So it is a little bit of guesswork this week because you never quite know in the FA Cup. But let's get on with it. So first game going in is Forest against QPR. Now Forest are awful defensively. So they always seem to score goals, but they just can't keep a clean sheet at all. QPR haven't been great going forward, but they seem to always nick one here and there. So I quite like the look of this one. So Forest QPR first team. From there, we're staying in the championship, and it's Rotherham against Preston. Now, Preston have done all right recently until their last two games, but they had Newcastle, so I can't really look too much into that because I think Newcastle will beat most teams in the championship this year. But their form has been good. Rotherham got a decent point at Leeds last week, scored two away from home. Kenny Jackett sort of let the shackles off a little bit and let them go and play. So, like this one, Rotherham, Preston, the next one going in. Now, FA Cup for the next one, guys. And we're going Southport against Woking. I had a look at their league stats, and it suggests they both like to score goals. So, I'm hoping it will be the same in the FA Cup, that they don't make too many team changes. So, Southport against Woking, next team going in. From there, we're standing in the FA Cup, and we've got Colchester against Chesterfield. Again, looking at it, both teams, it suggests that both teams score goals. So, I just really like the look of it. Um, like I said, I am guessing a little bit on team news with the FA Cup, but on their lead form, really like it. Now, the last one to make up our five-fold both teams to score is going to Scotland, is Dunfermline against Wraith. Now, again, both teams have a huge goal difference. They both like to score goals. Um, and... It's a league game, so I've gone off the form and I can't see that changing, I have to say. So that's the that's the five games that are in the bet slip now for you all guys. That pays nearly eleven to one, which for a five fold I think it's a, a decent bet. It's just a straight ten pound win on it. We're not gonna stagger it because it's too small. So that's the bet. Really hope you like it guys. Like I said, have a great weekend, whatever you're doing, Friday, Saturday, North London Derby. Not looking forward to it, I have to say. Team news could have been better today. Toby's out injured, which is a massive blow for us. But hey ho, um, we love our teams and we support them when they win, we support them when they lose. But have a great weekend, guys. Please follow me on Twitter at Phil Bars. Any questions, fire them across. Please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Any questions, just drop them in the comments box and I'll always answer them. Have a great weekend, guys. Thank you.